What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Elder Scrolls V Skyrim video here on the channel. So in the last video, we successfully went into the Soul Cairn, talked to Serana's mom, uh, destroyed the Keepers, got our soul back. We did a lot of things in the previous video. I thought it was a pretty good video, all things considered. We even got Arvac, which is pretty cool. So I suggest that you guys go back and watch the previous video. Uh, just because of the sheer number of things we successfully managed to do in that video, but uh, in this one, we're basically just gonna continue on with the story. We're no longer in the Soul Cairn, obviously, as you can see, there's uh, no creepy, ghostly things here. So, in this one, we are actually going to, I guess, seek. Wait, hold on, what's the yeah, seek disclosure? So, we have to go back and take this to to uh. Dexion or whatever his name is so that we can get these red so that's what we're going to be doing in this video If you're excited for this video do me a huge favor drop a like on this video Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow So with that being said, let's jump right into this. All right, how do I get out of here again? All right this way clearly So let's just go Is it actually telling me to go this way? Let's see here Oh, wait, that's not it. <coughs> Excuse me. I have a little, uh, tickle in my throat, just so you guys know. So I might be clearing my throat a little bit throughout this video. So bear with me, guys. I hope you guys can honestly understand. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, the, is it really gonna, I don't think I have to go, I really don't think I have to go all the way through here to get out of there, man. I'm fairly confident there's like this way out from the place where we were just at, so there's gotta be, right? I think it's like, uh, it goes into like this bridge or something. Let's see, hold on. I'm fairly confident, actually. It's gotta be this way, maybe? There it is. Volcahar Balcony. You know what we should do really fast while we're here? We do have a level up, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. <clears throat> um, Let's go with health. Um... Let's go with archery. Damn, we're already at 81. That's insane. Oh, yeah. Let's get max damage out of this. What else do we have available anyways? Requires 60, 70. Man, we're pretty much... We're in a good situation here. So let's go into the map. I think Dexion is where? Dexion... Uh, where's the arrow? All right, it's way down here. Oh, it's back at Fort Dawnguard. Isn't Dexion some... I don't know. Maybe he's the the Moth Priest. I don't remember, to be honest. Let's see how... Uh... Oh, wait. We're actually up here. Look at that. There's a... A camp, down, a camp down there. But for some reason, it has, like, the Imperial Legion insignias on there. I don't know why. But whatever, let's go back in here and see what we can take care of with Dexion. Hello? Anybody here? Is this what's his name? I knew it, it would is. come to this one day. I knew it. And no one believed. That's uh good to know. Thank you. Where is Dexion? Um Be on your guard at all times. There he is. Avoid sleep. I trust your journey was successful. Uh it was. But I kind of brought the Elder Scroll for you. I'm sorry, my friend. I can no longer be of use in this matter. Uh what happened? It's my fault. In my haste to read the first scroll, 
I neglected the careful preparation required. I thought I'd be able to allay the after effects, but I was wrong. Now I am paying for it. Um. So does that mean that you're blind? Blind? Yes, I'm afraid so. That's uh unfortunate. Can we do anything at all to help you? No. It will have to run its course. And there's always the chance I may never recover. <laughs> That's kind of rude. He's like, well, th then we're finished. <laughs> no, there is another way. The question is, how much are you willing to risk to find Oriole's bow? Well, I guess, what do I have to do? I can't guarantee you'd be free from harm. <clears throat> Becoming blind could be the least of your worries. Don't worry about that, man. Just... Do me a favor and tell me. Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as Ancestor Glades. There's one in Skyrim in the Pine Forest. Performing the ritual of the Ancestor Moth within the Glade should provide the answers you seek. So, do me a favor and explain this ritual for me, please? It involves carefully removing the bark from a canticle tree, which will in turn attract Ancestor Moths to you. Once enough of the Moths are following, They'll provide you with the second sight needed to decipher the scrolls. Uh, carefully gather the bark? How exactly do you expect me to do that? In keeping with tradition, you must use a specific tool in the Ancestor Glade, an implement known as a draw knife. Every moth priest is taught this ritual, but few ever get the chance to perform it. You should consider yourself fortunate if it works for you. Do I need to read the scrolls in any particular order? From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. Um, uh, is it normal for a moth priest to go blind? Sadly, yes. It is the inevitable fate we agree to pursue when reading the Elder Scrolls. It generally does not occur until a moth priest is in his latter years, but in my case, I simply was not preparing myself properly. So what exactly went wrong then? Deciphering one of the Elder Scrolls is nothing like reading a simple book. There is quite a bit of ritual and concentration required. It can take months or even years to complete a single scroll, and even then, months to recover. Damn, that sucks. Um, all right, thank you. Good luck. Hold on. Uh, unseen visions. All right, find a moth priest knife. I hope you find the answers. Let's get out and then we'll look at the map and see where exactly we need to go. Oh, come on, let's go. So we need to go where? <clears throat> Where's the arrow? Is it... Where? Where's the arrow? I'm not sure. Oh, wait, it's down here. Okay. Oh, it's over there by Falkreath. So let's go to the Guardian Stone, I guess. I guess we could go here, right? I don't even remember discovering this, to be honest. But let's go here, and then we'll run to the location. I never—I don't remember going there, though. <clears throat> All right. So that's that. I'm tempted to discover that little shack. But then again, I'm also tempted to not. <laughs> And just continue running to my mission. Hold up. Oh no, we're getting attacked by someone. We should probably help her, huh? Let's go. Dude, I just hit her in the back of the neck. Screw you, lady. Oh, you're screwed, man. It's all of us versus you. Get away from me! Come here! <laughs> and she fell off the mountain. 
Oh, there's another one. Come here. Never mind. She's dead. Good job, Serata, and everybody involved. Let's go ahead and try to make our way through this ridiculous looking mountain. Do I have to go up there? I hope not. Because I don't want to go around the mountain. Like, I really don't want to go around the mountain. I think that's what's going to have to happen. Or... There is another option. Yep. I'm, I'm just going to fly. Let's go. Look at that. Who would have known that an Imperial knew how to fly? I would have never guessed. That's crazy. And just like that, steal from chest. No, I don't do, I don't do that kind of stuff. All right. I wonder how far I would have had to go just to get the two here. For the record, I don't normally cheat in the games. I did it for the whole purpose of expediting this uh, video because I did not want to go around and I didn't feel like editing that area, so. If this ends up being a wasted trip, your friend Dexian and I are going to have some words when we get back. Uh, if you mean you're going to kill him, it's a little excessive. But we'll see. Dexian seems like a good dude. Look at butterflies! Are we in Stonehenge? I guess we're at Stonehenge. Let's put our thing away. <clears throat> Alright. Here's that ancient tool. Alright. Gather bark from the tree. Alright. Harvest. I can't even say that, so. Very nice. Wait, hold on. Is that it? Alright, good. Bark as much as Dexian said they would. So I need the butterflies now? Do I just walk right by them? I don't remember. So I got one out of seven. Okay, there's some, some right here. That's two out of seven. This should be three. There's some right here. Okay, four. Let's see if we can find some more. Okay, this is five. They're not very hard to find. That's a good thing. Is there some over here? <clears throat> yes. Come here. Don't make me fall off. Oh man. All right, so we just need one more set of butterflies. It is kind of distracting having these fly all over me because I can't really see. There's some up there, but I can't go up there. All right, so let's go down here. Okay, that's seven. Good. So enter the column of light. I will. I just kind of want to explore really fast. Who knows? Maybe I'll find a chest or something. Nope. Nothing here. Enter the pillar of light. Whoosh! That was an accident, I'm not gonna lie. Nervous? I don't know what I'm doing. Uh Do I have to do anything in particular? <clears throat> What is it? Uh, have you ever seen anything like this? It's not like anything else in Skyrim, I can tell you that much. From now or 
before. There's probably groves like this all over Tamriel. Most people just don't even know what to look for. Uh, does it bother you that we're working against your father? I can't say it surprises me. I kind of figured we were heading for this someday. I just didn't know when. Today! Uh, will it be hard for you if we have to kill him, though? If. I've been assuming that's where all this is going. I've been trying to make my peace with it. Come on. We can talk about this another time. Okay, sounds good. I'm trying to get it here, but it won't let me. Get out of the way. Let me in. Hold on, what's the what's the quest say? Oh, and read the Elder Scroll Blood. Alright. Uh would it be under miscellaneous? No, maybe books? Uh there it is. It said blood, right? So blood. Oh snap. What is this? Oh, snap. Do I... What? What's going on? Are you okay? I nope. I lost you there. You went as white as the snow. Yeah, I don't know what happened, though. That was pretty random. Are you okay? I almost thought I lost you there. <clears throat> you went as white as the snow. Yeah, don't worry, man. I'm 100% fine. I never trusted those damn scrolls. Who knows what those things could have done to you? Just look at Vexian. What about Ariel's bow? Do you know where we can find it? Uh, it's in a place called... Darkfall Cave, apparently. Then it's almost over. We can finally put an end to this ridiculous prophecy. Where is this Darkfall Cave? The scroll gave me its exact location, actually. Then let's get going. I want to get there before my father has a chance to track us down. <coughs> Will do. Uh, what do you know? What exactly do you know about Ariel's bowl? Not bowl? Much. Bowl. <laughs> any history, it shows up from time to time, but it's a hard thing to track. As far as I know, though, it's never been held by a vampire. That would be a new one. And what exactly does it have to do with the sun, though? Ariel is one of the elven gods. He's with the rest of them in Aetherius. The way I feel it, the ah! sun represents the connection from- Get away from me! Where'd you come from? That's what I want to know! That was random! You! Let's go. Got him. And we got a dragon, I mean a gargoyle with us. So let's make our way up there. Were these vampires? It was. Alright. Where are we headed? There's probably more up here. Where are they? Get away from me! It's a master vampire! Help me, friend! Oh, snap, I fell off. How do I get back up there? Oh no, she died! Where's Serana? I wish my dog would do something. But I guess that would make this game pay to win, huh? I'm having deja vu for some reason. Die! Get out of here, you master vampire! Your soul is ours. I, I guess. 
I'll be taking all of your good stuff. Thank you very much. That should be it, right? Because everybody else is dead. So let's go ahead and get out of here. So now we have to go... To the actual location of Ariel's bowl. I keep saying bowl. I'm not trying to eat some cereal here. I'm trying to get a bow. -a. Bow. It's absurd, I swear. So let's get out of here. We'll look at the map right now and find out exactly what we're supposed to be doing. All right, let me see. Uh, map. Where exactly does it want us to go? Oh, we've already discovered this place. Oh! We actually discovered it at one point when we were trying to get up this mountain. All right, but let's look at what we're supposed to be doing. Uh, so the visions provided uh, by the Elder Scrolls seem to indicate that Ario's bow with a W uh, may be located in a place known as Darkfall Cave. I should proceed there as soon as I'm prepared if I wish to recover the bow and stop Harkin from completing the uh, tire tyranny of the sun so this is called touching the sky dude we're like pretty much at the end of this dlc pretty much at least it feels that way so let's go ahead uh we'll go to dark fall cave right now and see what we could do here all right there we go. Hurry up, Serana. But we're going to go ahead and leave it right here right now, guys. It's a shorter video, I know, but my throat's a little raspy and it kind of it's, it's kind of ticklish and kind of feels kind of annoying. So uh, I'm going to definitely cut it short here on this video. I hope you guys understand. But don't worry. We're probably going to end up finishing up the, the DLC in the next video. So tune in for that. If you're excited for that video, or if you enjoyed this one, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.